Hi, this is part one of our hot air balloon pinal they're making. And I'm making this for my daughter's birthday. Um, so I already started out with the paper mache balloon for the top part. This is going to be the hot air balloon part. So I started with a balloon blown up as large as I could get it without it popping. And then <clears throat> strips of paper that were pretty cut pretty even so it could um, be smooth and also glue right. The glue we use for it is flour and water. So two cups of flour, two cups of warm water. And you dip the strips in, slide, I slid my fingers down like this to get the excess part off. So it just goes on really smooth. <clears throat> this is five layers here. So I wanted it pretty um, hard. So it's dried now, and as you can tell, it's pretty hard, and it's ready to decorate. So I'm still letting this sit while I'm going to start the basket. So the basket, this is what I'm starting here, is going to be suspended and hanging from the bottom of the hot air balloon. And <clears throat> what I did with the basket is I took a cardboard and I made the four corners. I paper mache it and I took golden wrapping paper and I wrapped it around it so it wouldn't have any see-throughs and what I'm doing for the decoration on it is I'm making the tissue paper flowers um, and gluing them on and I'm gonna probably continue around the rest of the box to make it decorated so how I'm doing the tissue paper flowers for the box is I'm taking, normally you do these flowers really big, but since we're doing it for this little box, they're going to be tiny. So you take your tissue paper, a couple different colors, different shades, and you fold it in an accordion position. And then what I did is I got colored rubber bands. So they match the colors on the inside of the um, tissue paper so it doesn't like stand out. So I wrap it around about four times and make sure it's in the center of your flower. And then all you do is you kind of fan it apart on both sides. And then you're gonna start to bring up the corners of each color. So I'm starting with the yellow and you gently, because you don't wanna tear it, pull it up and you kind of crumble it in the center a little bit like that and then you go to the other side and you do the same thing so now you're going to take the yellow up on this side and pull it around and get it to where it's together and it kind of starts looking like a flower here so you got that section now you're going to take the next color which is might not be able to tell but it's a little bit lighter orange than the outside Piece. and you go around the same way and we used to make these when I was little but we'd make them huge and they come out really pretty for decorations okay so you take the next layer and you put it around okay and then you have your last piece and you're going to kind of fold that up into the other parts there until you got something that looks kind of like a flower here okay so this is what it looks like on the inside and then how I'm doing it is I'm taking the box and I'm using a spray glue this tends to work really good for me because it dries fast and it sticks good the only thing you really want to watch is spraying too much of it and getting it on your fingers. So you don't need a whole lot of it. I spray a teeny tiny bit right there. Start at the bottom and I take my flower. I stick it to it and I'm going to hold it there for like 15 seconds and kind of push against it. Let it sit for about 15 seconds. I put my finger in the center just so it sticks good 
And when you put your flowers, you want to put them kind of like right next to each other. So there's no spaces there. And what we're going to end up doing with the box is putting strings, attaching strings on the inside of it that will go up to the balloon and suspend it from the bottom. So now when your flower's on, you just kind of fluff it so it looks like a flower. And it's already glued on. The glue already dried that fast. So this is the other side, what it looks like. So hopefully when I'm done with the whole box, this is the one side already done. This is starting the second side. The whole thing will be done and the flowers and the box will suspend from the top of the hot air balloon. So I will have videos to follow this up showing the other steps of designing the balloon and the final product. Thank you.